yes, I align myself to this horrible hole, but my last thought is the feeling of success that I had. And I'm going to relive that right now. There are certain holes where you just have to take your driver. Oh, there could be all sorts of reasons. Uh, you could be under pressure because of uh, your flight partners who have just hit great drives. You're playing a little private round. Or maybe it's the last hole and you need a birdie uh, to, to win the tournament. So you just have to take the driver, but it's a hole that you hate. It's a hole where you always find trouble. We all have these holes. And it just messes around with our heads and our rhythm goes out the window and you know what happens. So, what I do when I'm faced with these holes. I imagine that I'm playing a different hole. That I'm playing a hole that I've already played before in my life. And it's a hole where uh, the conditions are similar and where I really overcame my fear and hit a brilliant shot. I can see the shot. It's actually a shot that I played 30 years ago in Cape Town and uh, oh, there was a road on the left with lots of cars, lots of spectators and somehow I hit a high draw. Now that's exactly the ball flight I need here. And I'm going to imagine now, even though I hate this hole, that it's 30 years ago and I'm feeling and seeing all those things. So immediately what happens, it just relaxes me. It gives me positive energy. Yes, I align myself to this horrible hole, but my last thought is the feeling of success that I had. And I'm going to relive that right now. And I can promise you that was a good ball. Maybe a little bit too much draw. Okay, so I'm sure you've done wonderful things in your golf past. Use those memories. It really does help.